Hey guys, welcome to my garden. This is going to be a short video. I'm going to be talking about how to grow a lot of okra. I'm going to be pointing out some few tips. And I am going to show you how I do it. Okay. Well, the first thing that you should know when growing okra is that okra should be uh, grown during warm or during the warm months or the warm season which are the spring and the summer wherever you grow your okra you should make sure that it gets enough water and that will promote a maximum production and another thing, grow your okra where it will receive direct sunlight. Another thing, if you want to see your okra plant or producing a lot of okra, please make sure that you harvest it very often. Another thing, water your okra because it needs a moderate water supply. If you want to see it producing a lot of okra, you need to water it very often. I've been having these three okra plants since last year. Only three okra plants. As you can see in the video, I'm only harvesting the three okra plants. And I've been managing to get enough okra. Another thing that you need to know about okra, you don't need a lot of okra plants in your garden to get a maximum harvest. You only need a few okra plants. Here is the last ideal tip to maximize your harvest as you can see each plant is having more than one shoot that's the key to have a lot of what of okra from each okra plant you need to trim your okra plant by trimming i'm talking about simply cutting off the shoot when you cut a single shoot, more shoots will come from your okra plant. I usually start a trimming my okra plant at this stage. I know it's an early stage. Look at how tiny these okra plants are. Trust me, this will never go wrong. This way of uh, training your okra plant will not kill it will not kill it but it will help the okra plant to develop a lot of a uh, shoot a uh, multiple but it is advisable to simply trim your okra plant before it starts producing what uh, flowers or buds before it starts producing buds and flowers you trim it just like that make sure that you use a sharp and a clean pruner so that you won't transfer some gems throughout the okra plant you can also use a sharp a scissor to simply trim the shoot off Immediately after trimming your okra, make sure that you water it very well so that it won't dry out. Or you can just uh, do the trimming during the evening because transpiration is less likely to okay. You can also do that during the rainy days as you can see in the video 
after a week you'll start seeing some results as you can see more than one shoot is coming out from the from each okra plant more than one in some you can see three in some four okay. new shoots developing from the okra plant and in this way you'll get a maximum harvest from each okra plant anyway guys thanks a lot for watching please like share and subscribe